happy with, with what you've seen tonight from the lads? Yeah, yeah, it was, you know, it was a conditioning thing. Um, you know, we came up against a really stubborn side. Uh, there was things we needed to really improve on. I thought our fitness levels were really good, uh, and that's what it is. It's um, as, as everyone knows about my, my early scenes. Uh, you know, it's, it, it's it's not really about results in pre-season. It's, it's, it's about conditioning, and I thought we've we've done we've done really well in, term, in terms of you know just in terms of our, our overall fitness. It's been, it's been good. Played two hours with two different sides. Uh, any preference on which side did the best out of the two tonight? I deliberately mixed them up. It gives me a look, and um, it just shows me what we you know, what we could do with with bringing in. And, uh, but I, I thought the lads have worked hard. They've worked hard all week here. Um, you know, we was pleased with the following. It's always nice when you know when, when a number of people follow you as, as we've done tonight. And um, I'm hoping they enjoyed it. You know, we, we, we couldn't put a we couldn't put the ball in the net. And we looked a little bit probably rusty in the last third. Um, but like I say, it's, it's 45 minutes for, for a lot of them now, and that's um, it, it, the big positive is we've got that out of the way now. Let's touch on the new boys. Uh, the new two new boys at the back tonight. Paul Black and John McComb in the first half. Happy with their performances? Yeah, well, we've kept a clean sheet. I, I, if I'm going to be totally honest, I can't remember uh, the opposition having a shot on target throughout the game. But um, like I say, yeah, the, the, the new boys, it'll take a bit of time to, to settle in. But like I say, Rome wasn't built in a day. And we're 45 minutes in now. And that, it's important now we've got that out of the way on a on a 3G surface that's, that's hard to play on sometimes. It's, it's a small, tight little pitch. And... But yeah, it's, it was all about conditioning. It's all about conditioning now. But we can, uh, like I say, we can, you know, we can we, we can progress from here now. Just uh, hopefully finish off the, the you know the chore well, and um, you know we've got, we've got some good games coming up next week. The game got very competitive in stages, and you were quite animated at times. Were you were you worried at times about the players getting injured? Yeah, I was. If I'm going to be totally honest, I have to tell the truth. I thought some of the refereeing decisions yeah, were, were absolutely atrocious. I thought some of the refereeing was. It was absolutely just despicable, you know, but uh, that happens. I'd, I'd, I'd rather I'd rather have a, uh, a competitive game, um, but like I say, we, I think we was lucky not to come away with a few injuries after some of the tackles, and then all of a sudden the, the referee thought, felt he had to book something, you know, JJ for what was just a, a, a normal tackle, that, 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 you know. But like I say, we, we're out of the way. Hopefully, we will come through it, um, you know, with no injuries and. And hopefully now we can we, we can enjoy the rest of it and uh, progress next week. The whole Malta experience, you talked about conditioning and playing football in these conditions, it's got to serve the boys well, hasn't it? Well, I think if you look at the, the state the lads are in at the minute, you, you look at the likes of Reed, some of the players, Hutch, um, the, the, the body shape, everything about them is, is a lot better than it was this time last year. So, But it's early days yet, you know, we're not, you know, nobody's singing from the rooftops. We know we can get a lot better at a lot of things, but there was a lot of good aspects here tonight. I thought our fitness levels were excellent, and I thought there was, there was only going to be one team that went on to win it. But like I say, we looked a little bit rusty in certain areas, um, but that, that's, that's going to come. It's going to come with um, you know, more games and um, you know, a, a better fitness. A few more pieces of the jigsaw required, you've admitted that. Can you give us anything on that at the moment, anything impending? Well, we've just lost uh, a centre forward that scored as 56, 57 goals in two seasons, so it doesn't take a rocket scientist to work out that you know, I'm, I'm in the market for, for, for a centre forward that can score goals, but you know, we, we've got others. You know, Klux has come on second half, his movement, good movement. I uh, thought Lyndon looked sharp, um, Stevenson, Reed. You know, we, we look through the side, they, they, there's good players all through there, but um, it's early days, it's early days, and uh, I just thought the lads worked extremely hard. It was only what I expected tonight. I, you knew they'd be rusty in, in certain aspects, um, and I think the, the, there's a lot we can improve on, and, I, and I'm sure we will. You touched on it earlier, but I've got to talk to you about our fans. I mean, absolutely amazing following. All these lads and lasses travelling from Mansfield to Malta. You must have been chuffed to bits with them. Well, it's really humbling. I, I've said it on a, a number of occasions. You know, we, we've, you know, it's not as if we've, you know, we've, we've just gone up the motorway. It's, uh, you know, we're, we're a couple of thousand miles away, and um, to see, to see the, is it a couple of thousand? Is it? Well, we're, we're, we're a few, we're, you know, we're a few miles away you know, from, from from our coast, and. Uh, it's really humbling to see this amount of people, not just travel, but, but support us the, the way they've done tonight. And it's, um, like I say, it's, it's just testament to, to how, big, how big this club can be. Glass of wine tonight, then back to work tomorrow? Well, the lads are going to have the night off. Yeah, you know, they've worked extremely hard. Yeah, they're, they're, going have a, they're going to have a pint. Hopefully, you know, they'll, they'll, they'll mingle with the supporters and hopefully there's a really good atmosphere in town tonight. And uh, I hope everybody enjoys the night. It's, uh, like I say, it's, it, it's, it's the first of what I'm hoping is going to be many, many trips. Thanks, Paul. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs>